Arkansas could join other states that have banned the use of TikTok on state-issued devices. Thanks for joining us for your 5 News at 6. I'm Darren Bob. And I'm Erica Thomas. Last week, we told you how governors from multiple states, including Oklahoma and Texas, have banned the app with executive orders. 5 News reporter Catherine Goker takes a look at a new bill filed at the Arkansas State Capitol. An Arkansas senator has filed a bill to prohibit public entities from using TikTok on any state-owned or leased devices, including phones and computers. If this becomes law, it would mean state agencies like the Department of Health and RDOT could not use a social media platform to get their messaging out. I think before the end of 23, you're going to see most of the states of the United States ban this app from, from government phones. State Senator Gary Stubblefield is talking about TikTok. He authored a bill that would prohibit public entities from using the TikTok app or visiting its website on state devices because of security concerns. TikTok is owned by Chinese company ByteDance. U.S. officials have warned that the Chinese government could force the company to share its data. Well, the more data they can collect, the more money they make, which is an incentive for more and more people, uh, these kids, to to download this app. Stubblefield, a Republican who represents District 26, which includes Franklin and Logan counties as well as part of Johnson and Sebastian counties. His proposed legislation comes as other states and the federal government assess the use of TikTok. The U.S. Senate unanimously approved a measure Wednesday night that would ban federal employees from using TikTok on all government devices. It's very important that we do not allow them to to have access to this data. Senator Greg Letting is a Democrat who represents Fayetteville. While he's aware of there being some potential national security concerns with TikTok, he's not familiar with them enough to know if those concerns apply at the state level. So I'm not necessarily against this legislation, but since TikTok does seem to be the way that so many young people get news uh, and, and learn so much about what's going on in the world, I'm, I'm sort of hesitant at this point to say that I'm willing to ban it uh, and, and to keep the state from being able to use it to reach out to young Arkansans. Unlike Oklahoma and Texas, who banned TikTok via executive order, the bill filed in Arkansas would become law if passed by both the Senate and House and signed by incoming Governor Sarah Huckabee Sanders. Katherine Gilker, 5 News.